Do you delight in the law of God? And let's go on to another test quickly. It's one of my favorites. Verse 6. The one who says he abides in him, in Christ, ought himself to walk in the same manner as he walked. Sometimes I'll say that and I'll see somebody on the front row just giving up all hope and salvation at that moment. What do you mean? Surely I am not converted. Walk as he walked. I have no hope. Let me just clear it all up with an illustration from my childhood. I was raised on a, well, we raised Charlotte cattle and quarter horses, and we were in Illinois. It snowed at times. And my dad would wake me up at about 5.30 in the morning, just a little boy, maybe six years old, and he'd always say, Paul boy, first Bible verse I ever memorized, Paul boy, get up, no rest for the wicked. That's what he would say. And I'd go out there, and my dad was this huge man with a long stride, and we'd go out there, and we would water the animals because the ice had frozen over. We'd bust the buckets, fill them up with water and go off across the feedlot. He would have one bucket in one hand, another in the other hand, and take off across that snow with the largest stride you could ever imagine. Well, as a little boy, I just thought my dad, he was just my hero. I was scared of him, but he was still my hero. And I'd fill up my water bucket and I was determined that when I walked across that feedlot, I would put my foot in his footprint. That I would do it. I looked like a drunken spider. I would fall down in the feedlot. So if somebody on the outside had been staring at me as a little boy watching me do that, they would have maybe mocked me. They would have accused me. They would have scoffed at me. They would have made fun of me. But there wouldn't be one person who would be able to say, that boy doesn't want to be like his dad. In all my flaunting and failures and stumbling and everything else, you could take a look at my life and you could see that little boy wants to walk in the steps of his father in the same way with the believer. And I've seen this countless times. Some young guy was like a bull in a china shop. He seems to do more wrong than good. But when you take a look at this young man, you can see something has happened in his life and all he wants to do is walk like Jesus. Yes, he looks like a spiritually drunk spider, but there's no doubt in your mind this boy honors Christ, esteems Christ, and wants to be like Christ. You know him to walk. And here's the great thing. The love of God, the safety net that gives us such boldness to take off and say, I will press on. I will enter in violently. I will walk like him. Because it mattered not how many times I fall. My Father in heaven knows he has made me righteous. And though a righteous man falls seven times, he will rise. Gives you that freedom to take off with no fear and walk like Him.